I'm ripping the bags. Whoops, sorry. I don't know if I was recording that whole time. Camera has had enough of me because it keeps turning off. Hello. Come on. Yeah, come on. <gasps> Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for spending some time out of your day to watch me. You probably are not, but that's okay. Um, but welcome, I am going to do a little Primark haul today because I picked up quite a few bits and I thought I'd share it with you. I'm going to Ukraine on Monday, so I've been picking up some bits in mind for that. But anyway, let's get straight into it. So, I've got a few bags and a whole pile of stuff on the bed as well so let's start with some boring stuff so I got some of these cotton pads I get these every time I go to Primark so I've got about six packets of them in my drawer I probably don't need any more but I pick them up every time I go because they're only 90p these are so much better than the normal cotton pads to take off your makeup with so if you use those normal tiny ones get these because they're a big oval shape so they can take up more of your face and you don't have to use as many to take your makeup off. So I've got two packets of those, lovely and boring. Chuck them on the bed. I got the car phone holder for three pounds. I go through loads of these, I've broken about four of them, but they are really good. That's just because I snap things. Um, so I always get a new one and for three pound, I don't mind replacing them every few months. So I've got another one of those for my car. I haven't seen them cheaper anywhere else either, so that's good. Um, I got some of these Ariana Grande socks, and I thought these were cute because they come in a nice lilac, white, and black. And they're a pound, reduced from three pound, and I always need socks. Does anybody else's socks just go missing? My dog, Pebbles, always has a sock in her mouth. Fun fact for you. Oh, let's, with the sock trend, I also got these. They were two pound for seven. So, essentials from Primark. Get your essentials from Primark. So, this is a nighty, a Toy Story one. It was six pounds. I love it, it's the cow print. I saw it and was like, oh my God, that's so cute. Um, so I had to get it. I've now got, I've got a thing where every time I go into Primark now, well, almost every time, I pick up one of their nighties because they're always bringing out new designs like Disney ones. I've got about, seven or eight I know it's a lot uh different like Disney ones and I've got a Toy Story one now and they're only six pounds but with these the only thing is they're really cheap which is great but I wash them and they shrink like a lot so I'll put them in the wash once and then they won't be long enough to be a t-shirt dress anymore um so I've sized up with this one. So I got a medium, which is a 12 to 14, and it is literally massive. It swamps me, but when I wash it, it should be the right size. So we'll see how we go with that one, but it's so cute. Um, I love pajamas. Primark is the best for pajamas. Oh, this was cute. Okay, so this was from the men's section. Oh, I've just realized the whole time I'm looking at myself. How rude. I should be looking at you. Hello everybody. <laughs> it's a big bright yellow in your face t-shirt. Let me pull that off. I got it in a large because I like things oversized. Um, and it was too, oh. It was £2.50. I'm such a mess. <laughs> it was £2.50 and I can't even remember what it says on it. It's all good. Don't sweat the small stuff. Stay in the moment. And that is a little quote that I need to carry on in 2020 telling myself so I thought um I would just wear this like as a bed top when I'm feeling down put on my bright yellow top and make me feel happy and read the quote yeah anyway enough of that <laughs> you can tell I'm not used to this these are some little essentials I got because we're going away on Monday like I said to Ukraine we got some little travel bits got a shower gel, nice and boring, which was a pound, which is quite a lot for that actually, but oh well. 90p, another, sh oh, we've got two shower gels. Don't know why I did that. A little toothpaste for 90p. And I got some of this blonde dry shampoo, which is a pound. I've already got one of these, but it's really good and it smells really nice. I don't normally use dry shampoo really, but if times are 
tough and you've got no time to wash your hair, dry shampoo is what you need. That's why it's called dry shampoo. Okay, now into some of the clothes. So I know people only care about clothes. I mean, you guys might not care at all about this. So thank you so much if you're watching. Does anyone else, I still do it. Me and my friends, whenever we used to go shopping, like on the weekend, we would always come back and do a fashion show of what we bought. And I still do it now. Or I always do a show and tell, like, look what I got today. My mum loves it. I got these velvet plush faux fur lined leggings, six pound. I wouldn't normally buy these, but I picked these up because I've said it so many times, you'll probably get bored. Because I'm going to Ukraine on Monday, it's meant to be really cold. And I don't think I'm prepared for how cold I'm going to be. So I thought I'd get these. And they've got, oh yeah, nice. They've got like a proper faux fur lining and they were only six pounds so i got those they should keep me nice and toasty and warm in the ukrainian weather coming off from that i got this this little lumberjack fleece so cute with a zip i got this in mind for ukraine as well um to just keep me warm because fleece is the material that's going to keep you warmest and i can wear a long sleeve top on underneath and this was eight pounds so i got this because I thought that's a really good price for a really warm, cute zip up. If I could zip it up. Fleece. Fleece jacket. <laughs> I'm a lumberjack and I'm okay. I sleep all night and I work all day. I think. Um, this is my little lumberjack top. Hasn't got pockets. Wish it had some pockets. I'll be in Ukraine in this. And hopefully, with my leggings and my fleece, I'll be really warm. Controversial now. Let's get controversial on the internet. I'm not going to talk about conspiracy theories or anything, do not worry. But I am going to talk... Wait, let's do a little reveal. Bucket hat. What do we think? <laughs> And when I saw bucket hats, I was like, what are people wearing? Like when people were wearing the clear see-through ones to festivals and stuff with the glitter in, I was like, what is that fashion trend? But here I am, a few months later, I've bought a bucket hat. Not one, but two. I'm not too sure. I probably look like an absolute... Oh, it was only £3, by the way. For £3, you can risk it. So you can risk buying it, giving it a go. If you like it, you like it. If you don't, you've only spent three pound. I also got it in this cute little fabric and it's got glitter on it. And this one was in the sale for two pounds, down from five pounds. Right, let's see the other. I kind of look like I'm going fishing, but will I ever wear them in public and have the confidence to wear them in public? Maybe not, but... Oh, that candle smells so nice. This candle is from uh, Aldi, by the way. Save some money. I've forgotten all the stuff I bought. This video is going to be really long. I'm really sorry. I also got this jumper. I thought this one was really cute. It has this, like, weird abstract face on it. And it was only £5. A bargain. It's like a weird... It's like a stony beige. But it's really soft. And I like little lady on it she looks like she's having a great time <laughs> oh i like this this is actually a really nice color i like it more than i thought i thought this color would really wash me out but yay more pajamas i should have done this in an order never mind i'll get better hopefully frozen it says do you want to build a snowman? It's got Olaf on it and it's got sparkles and it's long sleeve for the winter. This was just randomly on its own, like hooked somewhere, a little lonely Olaf and he was reduced to three pounds. So I picked him up. So he's got no trousers to go with him, but I thought I don't really wear trousers to bed anyway. So yeah, and I thought it was really cute. Who doesn't love Frozen? Who's seen Frozen 2? Frozen 2 is great, and I think it's better than the first one. Just saying. More pyjamas. Tweety pie! This was £7 for the set, which I think is so good. I don't need any more pyjamas because I've got so many. But I had to get this because when I was younger, I looked like Tweety Pie, so everyone called me Tweety Pie. I was a really ugly baby. I had like, my profile would be like a giant big forehead, a little nose, and I always used to sit there like this. Or doing this. 
um, and then I had big blue eyes and like I only grew like a little white blonde tuft of hair on the top of my head didn't grow hair like for ages and was all bald everywhere else I had to get these because it's me this was a really exciting find now I don't really like the material of it not gonna lie but I saw it and was like oh I love that because I love this print it's just like a old it's like a granddad hat pattern if you know what I mean this is a jumpsuit you probably can't see because I'm so close and I'm backed up in the corner. Oh, I almost set that on fire. This was reduced from £20 to £5, which I think is incredible for a jumpsuit. Oh, no. Okay, this is a big shame and a big fail because it just... Does anyone want this? <laughs> gutted i also got a jumpsuit which was also reduced from 20 pounds to five pounds it was reduced from 25 pounds actually even more a bargain now i love this one more it's like a beautiful creamy white color now this material is really soft this one's a denim jumpsuit but this is a really nice soft material and it's got like contrast stitching on the pockets and the details of it it's like a nice beigey color i'm not showing that very well but yeah i really like this and it's got again the tortoise shell buttons single man reveal yourself god do i really look that bad oh i look like i'm about to come round and do your painting <laughs> i don't know I think I need slimmer, longer legs for these kind of things. But at least I tried and they were only five pounds, so. Another flop. From 25 pounds to five pound, I think that's an absolute bargain. Now, you've probably seen this everywhere because it's just a jumper, it's nothing special. And they also did it in grey. But this is the black version and it's this really soft high neck jumper with a zip. And it's also got like a toggle. And I just think it looks really cool. And the little toggle on it allows you to make it cropped or like wear it bigger. So I'm gonna hopefully wear that in Ukraine as well. Like all the high neck zip stuff and I can layer it and hopefully be really warm. <laughs> Obviously, I won't wear this with these joggers, but I love this jumper. I love it. Yeah, it's not very flattering with these joggers. So you can have it nice and baggy like this. Or you can push it up over your hips and have it as like a cropped. Cute! This is so cosy and you can zip it up. I love this. Arizona. Where is that? Somewhere in America. Oh, that was £10 and I got a size small. This, I love this as well. I got this, I don't know what print this is. This long skirt. It's not a maxi skirt, but it's like, it comes, it's almost maxi skirt, but it's got a little cheeky split in it. And I thought this would look really nice. I really want to wear this with like my DMs. It's got a little zip at the back to zip you in and it fits really nicely on my waist actually. Um, and I got this in a size 10 and it was 10 pounds. Love it. Oh, I can do this. I'm an idiot. I can just do this. So like maybe like tuck this front bit in i don't know i'm not really a fashionista yeah wear this with some boots trying to hold back this feeling for so long and if you feel i got this little t-shirt dress for five pounds be soft and it was only a fiver just a basic t-shirt dress really it's actually really short it's actually really short. Oh, maybe I'll just wear this as a t-shirt then. Yeah, this is not gonna be a t-shirt dress, sorry. T-shirt it is. Sorry, I'm racing through because I've still got another big bag on the floor. Well done if you're still here. And if you are still here, or if you haven't already, please subscribe to my, ooh. Let's try that again. Please subscribe to my channel because I'm going to 
be pushing myself to upload regularly so I'm gonna try and do a video a week I work six days a week at the moment sometimes seven so I'm very busy but I love this so much and I love talking to people and I'd love to have you here and I'd love for you all to watch me and all my friends and family out there um because this is fun <laughs> so anyway back to the clothes I got this black basic fitness top from the Primark workout range I've had some of the Primark workout stuff before and I actually think it's really good I've watched quite a few um reviews of it on YouTube of their new stuff and this was only four pounds and I got it in a small again which is a 10 to 12 um, and I got that and to go with that I haven't actually tried these on yet but I'm really hoping they're good these are the black activewear high-waisted leggings um these were only 10 pound and they go to like a fade to like a gray at the bottom the high waist part on it's like seems really thick so hopefully you can yank them right up but yeah we will see if i like those anyone else do this little wiggle wow they're nice and high waisted okay i actually like these they are a bit like tight they're not as stretchy as i thought they would be but that's just my big legs probably Dilly would be really proud of my plies. I got two, I'm gonna race through these. I got two little pinafores from Primark. They're like the corduroy pinafores. These were actually in the sale for five pounds each. I got a nice little camel color, a nice little black one. And they're originally 13 pounds. I got them for five pounds each, which is a bargain. I don't know if I was recording that whole time. Let me check, hang on. Um, I was talking about this cream, long sleeve top which was exactly the same as the other one but it's slightly different it's not the same this one's more of a brushed soft material the other one's a bit more sucky any material one of these two was reduced to three pound not sure which one they were both originally six pound and i got them both in a small i've got that cream top on well one of the cream tops on with the little pinafore dress i like the pinafore dress the cream top's a bit long yeah, I don't think this colour suits me. I think I'd wear this shade with a black top because I don't like this. Yeah, don't look good at me. But um, I like the pin for it's cute. Don't like the cream top. So I might take that back. Okay, this is the other cream top. Wear it with some little black tights. Yeah, I thought they looked really cute with tights and boots and you could layer like a roll neck underneath or even when it gets a bit warmer, you could have like a little t-shirt underneath the end is near people this is actually the best bargain ever a big chunky chocolate brown knitted dress that was a mouthful this was originally 30 15 pounds um, and it was reduced to three pounds so i was like oh i'll get that and it was the last one on the hanger i got to the till it was actually one perhaps what uh one perhaps it was actually one pound so absolute bloody bargain that one. Oh, it's not flattering though is it oh the one pound dress sounded like a great idea don't think it is god why do they always do this maybe if i had a belt again it's really soft i love the primark knitwear it's amazing i've got so many knitted jumpers from there now i got some gloves for ukraine Reduced because we're changing season now. These were 50p, reduced from a pound. I got thermals for Ukraine. So I got the men's one in an extra small. They're the brushed thermal in black and they were five pound. And you can tell we're getting to the end. Three things left, come on. I got this little layered necklace, little gold necklace. I love gold necklaces. These were reduced from two pounds to one pound this was again from the men's section i should have shown this right at the beginning it says originals new york city on it and this was two pound fifty and i got it in a large to be nice and oversized because i wear all of my clothing oversized and lastly hallelujah i got this scarf which is a nice neutral checkered pattern and it was reduced to two pound from four pounds because we're changing over the season. Primark already has like so much summer stuff. Like I literally was shocked. I went in there and it was like bikinis everywhere and little slip things to go over your bikinis and towels and flip flops and little shorts. And I was just like, 
I, pff, it's still winter, please. It's only January. Well, it's February now, but I was just like, please let me enjoy my big oversized clothes. So yeah, I got a scarf that again, I could take to Ukraine, keep me warm. And that is the Primark huge haul. I think that's a pretty huge haul. <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much if you got this far. So I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much if you watched this. I'm getting used to all this and hopefully you're going to see lots more videos from me soon. I'm going to vlog Ukraine. Um, we're doing a Chernobyl tour. I'm going to vlog that as well. So hopefully you'll come back and watch that. And I'm going to plan some other videos to do as well. Thank you so much for watching. Please like this video if you enjoyed it and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of me and you want to support. Probably will have lots of people laughing at me, but that's okay. <laughs> Love you guys. Thank you so much. Have a lovely evening.